Hey everybody, um, I have another troubleshooting video for you guys. Uh, this one's going to be on file format conversions. So I have an M4A file. I want to import it into your Pro Tools session, but it won't allow. Uh, so we have to convert it to a WAV or an MP3. And rather than, you know, uh, downloading weird softwares that could potentially give you a virus, you can do this all on iTunes. So you're going to download your iTunes and then you're going to go to your file. You're going to open it with iTunes. Pops up. There you go. It's playing. Um, and then you want to go to your edit tab, go to your preferences, go to your general tab, and then you want to go to import settings. And in the import settings, it defaults to AAC encoder. Um, so what you want to do is you want to change it to wave MP3 or AIFF. I'm going to select wave, keep the settings on that automatic. That's just changing sample rate and bit depth. It does a fine job, so you don't need to change anything. Hit OK. Select the audio file that you want to convert. Go to File, Convert, and then hit Create whatever version you selected. I selected Wave, so it says Create Wave version. Successfully creates it. The Wave version's right here. You can just drag and drop that into your folder. There you go. You have your wave uh, format. Now, if you want to like find out where like the actual root folder is, just go to Edit, Preferences, Advanced, and here's the mapping to that. And that's pretty self-explanatory. So I'll let you guys figure that out on your own. But yeah, that's how you convert M4A files to a wave MP3 or AIFF. Thanks for watching. Uh, please let me know if this worked for you. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.